Okay, you guys, so this is my next meal. This is all 18 points. It is two pieces of bread with light mayo, chicken, pepper jack cheese, a serving of hot Cheetos, and then this is just mozzarella cheese with salami. So there's my lunch. Okay, snack time. I'm gonna have rice cake with cream cheese. I'm going to weigh the cream cheese on my little scale situation type deal. Makes me wanna wipe my tail. Mail time. Why is it doing that? It's weird lighting. Oh, it's coming from those, okay. Okay, so I'm going to turn on the scale now. So it's all zeroed out. The serving of this is 28 grams. How do you open this? How do you open this? How do you open this? Just gonna take some out, put it on, and that's only 10 grams. Okay, that's 26 grams, which is fine. So now I'm just gonna smear it. Smear is such a gross word, actually. Smear. So here it is. The cream cheese was five points and then the rice cake was two points. So it is a seven point snack moment. This is so bomb, 10 out of 10. So instead of making a smart decision, I made a stupid decision and I ordered McDonald's where I could have had a better choice, but uh, 15 points large fry. I got a 20 piece nugget, which was 25 points. Definitely tasted amazing. And then I tried a fish filet or a filet of fish. I might have tried one years and years ago, but bomb. So good. Six points. And then I had half of a large Sonic Blast. I think is what they're called for 34 points. So I ate all my points and I went into weekly, into the negatives. So I ate 119 points. So for my first meal, I'm having a sandwich with a serving of hot Cheetos. This is 12 points. The bread is two points. The chicken is one point. The pepper jack cheese is three points. Light mayo is one point or two points, I don't remember. Hot Cheetos is five points. So, that is what I'm having for my first meal. <laughs> I'm here with my girlfriend. Just kidding. Okay, you guys, next meal is just a packet of ramen. If you wanna see how I make it, watch the last video I did. It's honestly so amazing. So for a chicken, ramen is 14 points. So it is kind of hefty, but that's okay. Look how freaking amazing. Should I go for it? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> This is how I used to eat literal noodles when I was younger. I would just be like, I'm an adult now. Okay, you guys, next meal I'm having Chipotle. The bowl is, I think 13 points. Um, I have it in my thing. I just know as a, as a whole, this is 33 points. So I'm only gonna have half of the queso. It was supposed to come with chips, but it didn't. So I'm just gonna have this small bag of Doritos, but there's chicken in here, cheese, beans, fajita veggies, rice, and lettuce. So yeah. Okay, so I had a chocolate peanut butter yasso is the first thing. And then I ordered this like open face turkey cheesy onion sandwich, <laughs> some like cheesy and steak. E fries, it was pretty tasty. Um, then I got some Starbucks. This is just a chai tea. 
and I got some of their mandolin cakes, which is one of my faves. And I was craving a chocolate chip cookie. Oh my God, this sounds so good right now. <laughs> um, so I got one of those. Okay, you guys, so the next thing I'm having, if I ever say that I'm off a of track, it's, it's probably because I either had one of these, I plan on having one of these. It is a Sonic slushy, and I'm kind of obsessed. I get the uh, blue coconut with the cherry. The anemic in me says hell to the S, so that is what I'm having. Okay guys, so my tongue is blue. <laughs> That's from the slushy. The slushy usually takes me like a couple hours to drink. It's just one of those things that I like sip on, but I ordered Arby's. I got a large diet Coke. I think I've had Arby's like a couple times in my life. So we'll see if I actually like this place. So large curly fry. That's good. So good. I got a mac and cheese. It says stir before eating. Okay. Oh, look how cheesy. Okay. Do as they say. Stir before eating. So cheesy. Last thing I got is a crispy fish burger sandwich. Who knows what? Wow. So it looks like it's just tartar sauce the fish, some lettuce, looks good, smells good. Let's dive into it, shall we? <laughs> 10 out of 10 recommend. Okay, you guys, so I wanted to do something a little bit different than usual. Normally when I do these off track days or I show my binge eating, um, which is rare because I don't like to show days like this. Um, I don't show calories, but I figured maybe it'd be a good idea if I did because I think this is educational for me. I don't think I ever realized like how many calories I was eating. I would like it to be known that not every day I am off track is like this. Are there days like this? Yes, of course. But this off track day was just insanely bad. In total, I ate 5,121 calories. 